Now, let me ask you guys a question. What do you think about the 6-hour P365X Macro? That's the one that just came out that everybody and their mothers have been talking about. 17 plus 1. It's ported. It's got a true pick rail, flat face trigger. I'm guessing it's probably got their X-ray night sights. It does. Um, and it comes with two magazines. Guys, the price tag on this damn gun is $799. 99 That's $800 for this little SIG. And I don't know about you guys, but that seems way overpriced for what it is. I mean, don't get me wrong. I understand that the technology is there with the magazines, and it's a super slim grip. I totally get that. And it's kind of a first of its kind, kind of like the original you know, P365 was when, with its ultra slim stack and a half, almost a double stack magazine capacity with very slim polymer grips. Okay, but $800, really, for a SIG? And then if you wanted extra magazines at like $50 a pop, probably or more? Maybe, maybe I'm just being skimpy because it ain't got any money, but I, I don't think that that's an $800 gun, you know? $600, okay, maybe, maybe $600. Maybe between $550 and $650, I wouldn't be as, like, weirded out about it, but... $799.99. Hopefully that comes down in price as time goes on, but for $800, I can imagine that there's a whole list of other pistols that I can get my hands on that would suit me better for what this thing is intended for. Uh, and then I can get extra stuff with the money left over, like magazines, ammunition, and pay for a couple of range trips. You know what I mean? $800 for that damn gun right there. I don't give a fuck if it's ported or not. I just, it's price too high, in my opinion. But, you know, that's in my opinion. You guys let me know what you think down in the chat section below.